is the day December 6, 2022. Our key verse, Isaiah 52, verse 7, from the New American Standard Bible. How lovely on the mountains are the feet of him who brings good news, who announces peace and brings good news of happiness, who announces salvation and says to Zion, your God reigns. If a picture paints a thousand words, as the song says, then let me share to you a picture story of a beautiful experience. It's evangelism stint last Saturday at Rojas Isabella. It's part of the leadership training session of sharing the gospel. 28 members of the Victory Lagan went to Rojas for a two-hour witnessing. And on the right picture, you see me. Habang nagbabahagi sa isang rider sa Jollibee at gihintay siya ng delivery niya. Ang rider ay ito yung team nakikinig at sumabay sa prayer of acceptance verbally. Bakit ganon? Pagkit na ako lang. Ayan. Sa pangalawang ano, picture ay si Jun naman. Hindi niya tunay na pangalan. Ay tumanggap sa Panginoon. Verbally at sa tuwan ni Alex. Magkasama ko. Ay pinakain na rin niya sa table namin. Si Jun ay isang Muslim at nakuha namin ang kanyang pangalan. Para ma-follow up siya ng Victory Rojas. Nawa ay maging tulay siya sa Ministry sa mga Muslims. Ito naman si Alex. Nakasama ko habang kausap ang manager ng Jollibee. Nabigyan niya ito ng New Testament Bible at nangako si manager na babasahin niya yung gospel presentation sa likod ng New Testament at prayer ng pagtanggap. Siya ay ipapalo up ng Victory Rojas. Sa picture na ito, si Flor at si Jeline na partner niya, pati sa lounge na malapit sa CR, ay nag-share din sa mga nakatambay doon. Kahit sa mga nakatambay sa nakatambay sa kainan, ay nag-share din sila. Sa mga estudyante sa mall, Sa park, doon nag-share din sila Christy, Arian at Jem. Saan pa? Sa mga naghihintay sa terminal, nag-share sila Kenneth at Medjil. Sa waiting area, nag-share sila Aisa at si Miriam. Si Rinrin at si Cheng ay nag-share na rin habang bumibili sila ng ukay-ukay. Sa mga nakasalampak sa sahig, nag-share si Arian. Si King Jay at si Remy na ay nag-share sa mga pareho niya lang professional sabang nagpapahinga sa mga lilim ng kahoy. Nung makitang may bakante sa mesa, lumipat na rin agad doon si Miriam at si Aisa para mag-share sa mag-jowa habang kumakain. Sa kaliwa, si Lynn at Chris sa food stand na nag-share pagkatapos kumain. Sa kanan naman, si Lola habang binabasa yung prayer ng pagtanggap sa likod na pinigay ko ng New Testament Bible. Nasa katabing table lang namin siya. Gulat nga ako, nagbabasa siya kahit walang salamin. Nung matapos ang dalawang oras, nag-report kami at nag-share din kami sa Victoria Rojas tungkol sa mga karanasan namin. Almost 100 people were given New Testament Bibles and half of them evangelized and received the gift of salvation. Of course, meron din mga tumangge na nabigyan nalang namin sila ng New Testament Bible. 
Natuwa rin si Pastor. Yung third from third from right. Yung naka-gray. Marami silang pipitasin at alagaan na bunga. Evangelism is thin sa Rojas, Isabela. Last Thursday, Lore and Wisdom and I also joined an evangelistic caroling at Mayamot Saragosa. Kasama si Sister Dali, Sister Marcelina, Sister Menchi, Brother Amang, Albequero, and others who instead of asking Pamasco, the group gave packets of gifts and also the gift of salvation through sharing of the gospel. What a creative way of sharing at pwede rin maduplicate. Sa December 24 nga ay magbibigay din ang Victory Ilagan ng Noche Buena Package sa mga poor families sa Ilagan City. Hopefully magaya namin yung ginawa ni Albi Carol na nag-share. Isaiah 57 says, How beautiful upon the mountains are the feet of him who brings good news who proclaims peace, who brings glad tidings of, of good things, who proclaims salvation, who says to Zion, your God reigns. Tingnan nyo ngayon mga paa nyo kung maganda. Kasi ang maganda lang daw na pa yung nagdadala ng magandang balita. But although this is not literal, figurative lang. Isaiah prophetically sees the messengers bring their choices Good news to a sad and forsaken world. Said how beautiful on the mountains are the feet of those bring good news. So Romans 10, 14, 15, a cross reference. Nearly 1,000 years later, the Apostle Paul described a similar messenger proclaiming the good news of peace and salvation in Jesus Christ. He said, and how are they to hear without someone preaching? And how are they to preach unless they are sent? As it is written, how beautiful are the feet of those who preach the good news. So, nasa New Testament na si Paul, pero kinukot niya pa rin yung kay Isaiah. The Apostle Paul taught Christians to put the full armor of God as spiritual defense against the dark forces of evil. Ephesians 6 and verse 15 says, And as shoes for your feet, having put on the readiness, given by the gospel of peace. He described one piece of the armor as the shoes of readiness. God's armor means being ready and willing. Medyo nilagyan ko ng emphasis. Ready and willing to share the gospel of peace with those who need salvation. The good news of the gospel brings God's peace through Jesus Christ, proclaims His great love for us, and awakens us to his, gifts, to his gifts of grace and mercy. Ang ibang helio ay nagbibigay ng kapayapaan sa pamamagitan ni Jesus. At ang kanyang dakilang pagmamahal sa atin, ginigising tayo na ibahagi sa iba ang kanyang grasya at kawaan, grace and mercy. Let's pray. Lord, give us the shoes of readiness, the willingness to share the gospel of peace, the good news of salvation. Help us to proclaim your love. Awaken us to share your gas, your grace, and your mercy. People need you, Lord, but how can they hear without somebody preaching, sharing, talking to them, and loving them? Lord, you pray, send us. And this Christmas amidst the fancy celebration, we will make you the center of this season by sharing gifts to the poor and the unrich, especially the gift of salvation. Lord, don't allow distractions to blur our focus on sharing peace, hope, and glad tidings of joy during this Christmas. It is truly a fortune time, a Kairos time, because we are awaiting the advent of Christ coming here on earth. That's the meaning of Merry Christmas. In Jesus' name.